Hi guys, Joe here from Lawn Solutions Australia. Welcome to episode four of our Autumn Lawn Care series. In this video, we talk about our favorite topic, laying turf. Autumn is a great time to get some new turf down, as in most states, there's still enough time to get good root establishment before winter in most turf varieties. So, if you're looking to repair an area, or you want to lay some new turf, here's how you go about it. There's a number of reasons why you might need to lay some new turf and are looking to do so now. It may be because you've just got a new house that's just completed or you've got a worn out area that needs some attention or you've just put in some new drainage and you need some turf to tidy it up. Most Australian lawns consist of warm season turf grasses. Kaikuyu, Cooch, Zoysia and Softleaf Buffalo lawns are the most common types and fit into this category. As the name warm season suggests, that's the time when these grasses are actively growing and during the cooler months, they slow down and can go into a certain level of dormancy, slowing growth and losing some color over winter. There is a common misconception that warm season turf grass varieties cannot be installed in cooler conditions because of this. But this isn't the truth as warm season turf grass varieties can be installed all year round in most regions of Australia. There is even some benefits for installing new turf in the cooler months. The main benefit is the lower water usage. In the cooler months, you will not have to water your new lawn anywhere near as much compared to the warmer months as the days are not hot enough to dry out your new turf as quickly. Whilst it still needs some water, you can virtually half your water usage when laying turf during the cooler months and still maintain a healthy lawn come spring. The key thing you are trying to achieve is moisture into the soil to the depth of about 150 millimetres. This will ensure your roots establish to the soil easily and the grass will get the moisture it needs as it grows. Keeping the feet off your new turf damp but not soggy is key. Adjusting the frequency of watering to coincide with the current weather conditions will help to give the lawn every possible chance of staying healthy and robust. Another benefit is it's likely you won't have to mow your lawn until the weather warms up. This comes in very handy as the winter months have shorter days and weekends filled up with sport and other activities which makes it harder to find the time. Just be sure when it's ready for its first haircut you do it on a high setting so you don't remove too much of the leaf while the grass is most vulnerable. Lawn Solutions Australia turf farms undertake a number of measures to ensure the turf they supply during the cooler season is top quality. Some of the methods used include the use of frost blankets and ColorGuard Plus applications. ColorGuard Plus not only keeps the grass looking greener, but is also able to increase the surface temperature of the leaf blade. A darker leaf allows more heat energy to be absorbed, which can help limit the extent of both dormancy and frost damage. Just keep in mind, when laying a new lawn in winter, the lawn may not root down strongly until the weather warms up and it starts growing again. This doesn't mean anything's wrong and your lawn isn't dying, it's just sitting idle until it gets some warmer temperatures so it can fully establish. If you've got some turfing to do, you can get it done now and you'll have a fully established grass area by the time summer comes. Some varieties do have some specific requirements and may be best installed during the start of the growing season. So make sure you have a chat to your local Lawn Solutions Australia turf supplier for some advice specific to your location. Thanks for watching and we hope to catch you next time.